Hello world, welcome to Code Artisan Lab. We are creating a Django tutorial series and in this series we are creating a news website. So in this video, this is a second part of this series and in this video we will learn how to set up Django and how to create an admin panel for our news website. So let's start. So first of all, we will create a project. So open your command terminal and run this command Django admin start project news and then go to the news project and start a and create a application py manage dot py start app main so here my application name is main so i have created this application now if i see the folder here i have created a news folder news project and in news project i have two further folder main, uh, main application folder and project setting folder news and this manage.py is a, a setting file that we are running with our uh, python command line so now we will register our application into the project so open your project setting folder and settings.py and register your application now our application is connected with our project so we can create multiple applications in project so django comes with multiple applications here you can see that django contrib admin auth content type session messages static files so these are op application which comes with django when we install the django now we will create a admin panel for our website so before creating admin panel we will migrate the tables so here we will migrate the tables so django comes with some default migrations like we have seen that django comes with app admin auth sessions so we have migrated this app uh, these apps in our uh, in our database so django default django using sqlite so we are not changing your database we will also use sqlite so now we have uh, created our migration now we will create our super user py manage dot py create super user and this will ask some questions that what is the username what is the pa password e email so you can type whatever you like now i will run my server now i will run the django server the server is running now i will open the browser and open the project so this is our uh, welcome screen that uh, is showing that we have created uh, we have installed django successfully and when we access slash admin then it will show a login screen for our admin panel so it means we have successfully created our admin panel now we will type here username that we define uh, when creating our app uh, when creating our super user so i will type here so this is the admin panel of our website so here we will add our models and register our models with this admin panel so because we are creating we have we have news categories and comments so we will create three models 
so open your application and models.py and create a model first of all we will create a category model and we will extend this class model and in category we have so in category we can see that we need uh, two fields first one is category image and second one is category title so first one will be category image so category image will be a care field uh, category image will be a yeah, character field because we will store name of the image and the image will be save in folder so first first field is title this will be a character field and maximum length will be 200 and then category image will be models category image equal to models dot character field not character field actually it will be a image field and in this image field I will define upload to so this upload to define the folder in which we will save the image so I will create here images and now I will create a function so this function will return the so I will uh, explain this function when will we go to the admin so so here we will put return self dot title so our category model has been created so let's migrate this and then uh, let's migrate this and register this model in uh, register this model with our admin so that we can easily access the easily access the category model in this admin so we will see how to uh, uh, register the our model with admin so let's do this so open our admin dot py and here we will add first of all we will import our model that we have created import so our model name is category and then we will add admin dot site dot register and we will add this so yeah we have done so now we will see this so here we can you can see that we have application name model and category our category has uh, connected with our admin and you can see that here we have categories so now we will one thing that we have skipped here that we have uh, uh, created our model and connect with admin but we have not migrated yet this model so we will create a migration py manage dot py make migrations and this will create a migration file in migration folder and then we will create manage dot py migrate and now run we will run our server and then we will now we will go to the categories and here you can see that this is a category all listing page and when will you add this so here we have two field title and category image so this uh, so django create for us when we have when we create a model so this is our sports category sports sports category uh, it's a sports only and the file will be our 
file will be our our file I have to choose the file I choose this not this I will choose the Django file so I will create this file and save this so now we are now it is showing the list of category when we add more then it, it will show the all uh, categories here now here we have defined the string function so this is string function return the title that we can see here so it is showing because we have defined the default that what what we return default from this model so we want to return the title so we have defined this title so we are returning this title in the admin so when you you can edit this on clicking on this category you can add more categories sports uh, we have we can add more like education we have not added the image so you can see that this shows the error over here we will add this again now it now you can see that here we have two categories that we have created so we, so we have created uh, admin panel successfully and we have created a model and connect that model with our admin so in the next part we will show the data of categories in the front end and we will create the template so we will see how to create a base template a common template which will uh, in this uh, in the common template we will include the common parts and we will fetch the data of categories and we will make the our template dynamic so in the next video we will we will see how we can work on that so thank you